Hello everyone, welcome back. Today in this video, we will be looking for how to use large and small functions in Microsoft Excel. We can use large and small function to retrieve numerical values based on their position in a list when they are sorted by value. If you have a list of numerical data, from that data you want to find out the largest number, second largest number, third largest number and keep the largest number. So to get this result, you can use large function and similarly to get the smallest number, second smallest number and keep the smallest number, you can use small function. And in this video, I will explain how we can use this large and small function with an example. First, I will explain what is the syntax of large and small function. So the syntax of large function is equal large in brackets. There are two parameters. First parameter is the array. Array means our list of numerical data. So from that data, you can find out the largest number, second largest number and kth largest number. And the second parameter is the uh, position. So if we give k is equal to 1, you will get the largest number from that list. And if we give k is equal to 2, you will get the second largest and k is equal to 3, you will get the third largest. And also the syntax of small function is equal small the first parameter is the array and second parameter is the position so when you give k is equal to 1 you will get the smallest number when k is equal to 2 you will get the second smallest number and k is equal to 3 you will get the third smallest number when the value of k is equal to 1 in the case of large function which is similar to max function in microsoft excel and also when the value of k is equal to 1 in small function which is equal to min function in Microsoft Excel. So I will explain this large and small function with different examples. Consider this data as students marks details. The data contains a name of the students and the marks scored by the student in different subjects and the total marks. Here based on this total marks, I want to determine the rank 1, rank 2 and rank 3. Rank 1 means uh, the largest total marks and the rank 2 means the second largest and rank 3 means the third largest. So we can find out the rank by using the large function. So to get the rank 1, you can type equals large and the first parameter is our array. So select the range and comma so for first rank that is the largest number k is equal to 1 and close the bracket so 185 the rank 1 marks is 185 so to get the rank 2 uh, you can type it again or you can copy paste this formula So here I'm copy pasting the formula and uh, replace 1 with 2. So to get the second largest. So 184 is the rank 2. And for to get the rank 3, again paste and replace 1 with 3. So I got the third rank. So, so by using this large function, you can find out the largest, second largest, third largest and so on. Next, I will explain small function with an example. Consider this data as race details and the data contains name of the person and the race starting time and the finishing time of race and also the total time taken to finish the race. So, so based on this data, we want to determine who is the winner of this race. So the person who has completed the race within a short span of time is the winner. So we can use the small function to determine the winner of this race. So for first winner equal small and select the range. So to select the time and for to get the first winner k is equal to 1. So we will get the smallest value. So 
one hour and ten minutes. So the person James completed the race within one hour and ten minutes. So the winner of the game is James. And to get the second winner, you can use the same formula: small. And the first parameter. Select the uh, list of data and the second parameter. So second winner k is equal to two. And close the bracket. So one hour, ten minutes, and ten seconds. So Jane is the second winner. So, using this small formula, you can find out the winner of this race. So in this manner, you can use the small and large function to retrieve the nth lowest and nth largest value from a set of data. So I hope you got some idea about. how to use this large and small functions in microsoft excel thank you for watching